I'm Zach Hertz. I'm 28 and I've been blind for 26 years due to bilateral retinoblastoma. I never let that slow me down and these days I'm finishing up a bachelor's through Evergreen State College in Olympia, Washington. My experiences with schools in different parts of the U.S. have given me a wide perspective on accessibility. The one thing they all have in common is lack of accessible signs and assistive navigation. So with that in mind, I began designing and developing a service to address accessible, detail-oriented navigation. I began to recruit a development team from fellow students in the entrepreneurship group and computer science classes. In September, we started building reference point navigation and in just five months have a stable product that is showing steady growth. Relative to today's technology, the Americans with Disabilities Act is obsolete. In 1990, no one thought phones would be hubs of information. Following the ADA can be expensive and puts hardships on campuses. This results in outdated signs, which over time causes hazards. When we as people with disabilities are relying on accessible tools that aren't being maintained or improved, we lose our independence. Reference Point uses already existing sensors on phones to help accurately locate your position. Using text-to-speech, users receive step-by-step -step directions using landmarks and digital access points, which is more accurate than GPS. Reference Point allows users confidence for dynamic travel. Our verified maps offer multiple layers of information, and users can add customized landmarks. I see it as the next step of proving what can be accomplished through assistive navigation, along with the availability of information accessed by those with visual impairment. Our goal is that in five years, we will be nationwide delivering accessible, detail-oriented navigation from the palm of your hand. We would appreciate it if you'd please click the like button. The more likes we get, the better our chances on moving forward to the second round.